It is the first festival of the summer. We are back in Chicago, Windy City School Cup, four days. Lily Skew, Charlie McKenna has been here every single year. That's right. Uh, tell us a little bit about you know your Chicago story, you know, and when you guys start. Yeah, so Lily's Q opened in uh, 2010 up in Bucktown. We've now since moved uh, to a brewery, District Brewery Yards over here. Four breweries, we have a huge patio, so it's great. Been at Windy City Smoke Out for, I think this is the eighth year. Um, and what we're doing here this this weekend is we're doing walking tacos, so our Lily's Q pimento cheese chips, pork, coleslaw, sauce, in a bag, walk around, eat. We got Thai glazed ribs, so we did a little soy sauce, fish sauce, brown sugar, cilantro, kind of brine on them. Then we glaze them with another like, uh, mustard uh, gold glaze and then they get fresh herbs on top little sesame seed and then we have our potato salad which is kind of like a mashed potato salad and then on top we throw crushed potato chips and then some more chives for garnish so oh my god three items that are going to be crushed hopefully this weekend that's awesome that, that is amazing now how does it feel i mean we've only been here a couple couple of minutes so far the festival's been open yeah but there's so many smiles on people oh my god tell me about the feeling of you know, once this was announced, this would be the first one here. So last year when this got canceled, obviously I was very upset. It's one of my favorite events of the year, and I cook all around the world. Um, but this year when they said it's going to be able to go, it's going to be full blower, we're going to have no masks, we're going to be walking out here. So excited. I think Chicago's just bursting with ready to bubble up. Um, I think there's going to be, it's going to get packed. It's going to, it's going to be a great time. People are going to really enjoy themselves. And I think we deserve it. Right? We, did, we had COVID plus winter. I think that's a double whammy for Chicago people. So I'm excited to get everyone back out here, get people walking around, eating food, drinking, having a good time. Really kind of, hopefully, this is where I feel like it's going to click. Like, okay, life's kind of back to normal. Oh, exactly. Oh, exactly. And then final thing here, you know, what's your message as far as people coming out to support Chicago Land Festival, Chicago Land Restaurants? It's been a tough time, but there's yeah. so many great places, you know, that we need to support and keep alive. Well, there's some that, you know, fell off during COVID, which is sad. I Luckily, I had I was blessed enough to, like, get through COVID. Super excited, but as much as you can support restaurants and, you know, employees of restaurants and bars and all those things this summer, please do that. You know, we really need it badly, and it's not just for the owners, it's for the it's for the employees that work in those locations and all the stuff that they put behind, all the cooks that like work 12 hours to put out great food. So if you guys can get out and support us as much as possible, we'd be greatly appreciated. Charlie McKenna, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. I'm going to go get some food. Yeah, please. Let's go. <laughs>